What inspired you to recreate campus in Minecraft? So I played Minecraft back in 2012 and I loved the software. There's just so much opportunity. I've seen on like Reddit and all these social media that people are building these awesome buildings on Minecraft. So I was like, maybe I can do the same because no one had done it for Carnegie Mellon yet. So I decided to build the UC first all by myself. Um, <laughs> the whole thing? The, the whole thing, it took a long time. But I used Google Maps and I used the ruler function on Google Earth and everything to make sure it was accurate and to scale. I was building it block by block. So you see everything on the outside that you see was placed by, by my right hand in the, in the mouse. When I got involved through AEPI, which is a fraternity that I'm in, they introduced me to this thing called World Edit, which allows me to place hundreds of thousands of blocks at the same time. So instead of building each column block by block, I was able to take the, the column and copy and paste it. Probably I would think anywhere from 100,000 to a million blocks placed by me and then things changed once um, World Edit was introduced. How have other students gotten involved? I had a bunch of my AEPI friends become involved. They were really working with details like Legacy Plaza. One of my friends made the, uh, the food truck. The Tartan Express. Yeah, the Tartan Express. Yeah, oh, I Oh, that's so great. And then when it became into the CMU Minecraft server that everybody was able to see, I had several people online that was like, hey, can I get involved? And so he, I could give people access to certain land claims or the entire map, and they can make the changes they want to make. If they want to work on the UC, they can work on the UC. If they want to work on gates, they can work on gates. Same thing with Ween, Doherty, every building you can imagine. So what has the response been like once, you know, students started seeing when you first built the UC, you know, all the way to now? The responses have been predominantly positive. I really haven't seen any negative responses, which I'm very grateful for. It seems like this community really appreciates the work that me and my friends have put in. And um, I'm glad I was able to positively influence the Carnegie Mellon community because of it.